three years into the Locrian War. Lands fell victim to the demise, Salias Locrius. Thousands of years, Modus Masters, the ones who control sounds and vibrations, have chosen one protector for each land. Ionians heard their elders speak of a harpa, the protector of the Ionian forest who was deeply injured, but for reasons unknown, they chose not to send help. In Pangea, members of its youth possess a rare power to control the vibrations of the universe. This power forbids them from language, allowing communication to happen only through sounds. Driven by curiosity to see the forest, two children, Allegra and her brother Allegro, set out to secretly venture outside the sacred city's walls to save the harbor themselves. We made it, Allegro! I can't believe Maestro Babaton didn't listen to us. We'll show him. Save the harbor ourselves. But we haven't much time to waste. And still technically aren't supposed to be here. So follow me and do exactly as I say. Come on! over there.
never seen Babaton use it, but he never taught us. I wonder how it works. Too close. Ugh. Isn't it spectacular? Our ancestors fought side by side with the Brosaurus in this valley to preserve harmony. Thanks for coming with me. Well, technically, you really didn't have a say, but you know what I mean. In the beginning, there was only Pan, an expansion of space, not yet defined by time. Allegro, 
Listen. And in a single beat, rhythm shook into existence. From this pause, the vibration of Pan's drum time became relevant and Ut was born. Next, there was Soul, a symbiotic tone that resonated with Ut and held the concept of knowledge. Pan became aware. With this awareness, she went on to create Ray. La, me, see, and far. In unison, Pan and her tones make beautiful harmonies throughout their universe. She called them the Hepticards, the rhythms of the universe.
led me out. I didn't know how to find you. But, hmm, seems like you had a great ride.
happened to you? What is all this black goo on the ground? I wonder if this is what's making her sick. Hmm. Ocarinas usually have lots of colors. If they're gray like this, it means something's wrong. They protect themselves by blending in with nature, and when they're healthy, they generate beautiful harmonic tones from their nostrils. I don't hear anything. How can this be? How can we help her? I think... Yes! I remember now! The Morocco fruits! They're natural remedies for the ocarinas. They tend to grow under large Ionian mushrooms. See if you can find a couple. They're the ones that are red and glowing. healing response times, like almost immediate. But she still looks a bit sick. We need to get another Morocco fruit quickly.
Another Sukumba. Well, now we know the elders designed them to respond to the environment. There's got to be a clue somewhere. Oh no! How are we going to get across now? Oh, what's this over here? Could this be a clue?
Wait. Allegro. It's the spirit of the forest. The Pantois. <laughs> Great. This is gonna take a while. Pantois is one of the most majestic creatures of all the forest. He does not let anybody just simply pass. There are stories where people have starved in front of him for days. According to the Book of Nozamas, we need to maintain eye contact, respectfully bow, and stay that way until he decides to move aside. Huh. Let's hope it only takes a few. Uh, Allegro? Um... What's happening? Wait a minute. Is he really gonna let us ride on his shell? No way. Looks like today's our lucky day. Come on! No one has done that before. Oh. Where are we? Now what do we do? Oh, look, there's writing. An ancient Ionian tongue. No one speaks this anymore. Oh my oot. Allegro, we're here. It's the gate to the sacred garden Harpodopia, the heart of the Ionian forest. That means the harbor is just beyond this wall. Huh. I think I have to. Yes, I must sing these lines. Oh, hope we're not all too late. Babaton? Mm. What are you doing here? You told us not to meddle in nature's affairs just yesterday. Well, yesterday was yesterday. And today um, is today. <clears throat> and what are you doing here, miss? I thought I told you not to do anything and to stay uh, put. I mean, after hearing the elders talk about the harper and all... Oh, oh you were prying, hmm? Sort of... Yes. But that's not the point. You taught us how to communicate with her, and... Oh, well, I thought maybe we could do something. See something even you might have missed. Oh, so now you're questioning my powers, are you? You taught us to always question your power. Oh, so much sass, not enough press. What? But my child, I know you mean well. 
But it is dangerous out here. Now, there's no harm in wanting to help others in need. Uh, never be ashamed of that. But I'm afraid your... your might is a little tight on time. Oh, dear, look at that. Oh, yes, I'm sensing pain. A lot of pain. Her rhythm is fading what do you mean? lately. Oh, war, war, war. Uh, the war! War has spread its destruction to the forest. I mean, the Triton army already occupy most of it, depleting this place of all its resources and forcing our majestic wildlife to seek refuge. This... this war is not theirs to fight, especially not her. You see, Harper's wings harmonize with the forest. It's where her energy comes from. If there is no forest, well... Oh, there is no Harper. So... Uh, uh. We do nothing. But... What about the pant voice we saw on our way here? He... He was all alone and... Uh, will he but, also not make it? Well, no, 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 that's not possible. No, no. We helped all of them relocate weeks ago to their new nests. And you, you know how hard they are to convince to... Uh, um... We definitely saw one. And it let us right on its shell. It was so unusual. It was making all these weird noises and... I thought we'd be stuck for hours, but... He looks right at Allegro like it knew him. Allegro, is he mute by birth? Um, obviously. Oh, by oh, how could I miss this? Oh, of course, of course, of course. There, there isn't a moment to waste. Oh, my goodness gracious me. No, now come, come, child. Come, she hasn't got a lot left in her. Uh, what's going on, maestro? Son, we, we have to heal the Harper. Now, I cannot do it alone. But you, my boy, with your help, we might. What do you mean with his help? Allegra, your brother here, is a crystal child. Well, that, that explains the behavior of Pantoys. He was communicating with them. Really? Yes, yes, I'm sure of it. Well, almost sure. Almost. Yeah, well, I mean, there's only one way to find out. Even the great Katerian Modices cannot communicate with Harper. But possibly your brother can. Now, come, follow me. Now, uh, don't rush. Don't rush. Feel the vibrations as we conduct. before the elders realize that oh, we're gone. Oh, no, 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 I'm afraid, I'm afraid. You two can no longer return home. Huh? We must get you to the Shakuhachi Temple. It's not safe here, especially for him. All the way to Phrygia. But this is our home. Pangea is your home. Ionia is but a house. And war is upon your doorstep, Allegra. Okay. You can't ask us not to defend what is ours. I've always admired your passion, Allegra. And I know you have so many questions. 
But now, my child, is not the time for lecture. I promise you, I will tell you everything on the way. Now, come now. <laughs>